What a lot of people do is they bypass or they change the sadness for something that will replace the sadness, another emotion to replace it, right? They force themselves to do it. Instead of acknowledging why the sadness is there or the anger or the hate, whatever comes up, instead of going through it and understanding why it's there. But what happens if you do this, if you bypass that anger, if you replace it with another emotion that you think is better, you don't allow yourself to be angry, you don't allow yourself to be sad, because sadness is weakness, blah, 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 all of those you know, socially indoctrinated systems that we have in place, all of those limiting beliefs that we have in place, right? That we always need to be so freaking positive, so affirmative, right writing affirmations everywhere no it's not about that you can still have your affirmations you can still have the I am enough I am amazing but if you don't allow yourself to be in the emotion if you don't allow yourself to allow it coming up acknowledging that it's there and owning it to understand where it comes from what is the trigger surrounding it you will never neutralize it you will never diffuse it instead it's gonna come back and bite you in the tushy because that's what it does